Oh my gosh, guys. We have these crazy cars made by Lossie over here. And these are literally crazy, guys. You won't know how fast these cars go. As you guys can see, these cars are so fast and they really drift really well and they're so cool. We're just gonna be zooming right over here. Woo! And we can spin. Let's do a spin. Woo! And yeah, so if you guys flip over, you guys can just get right back up. And these cars literally go so fast. We're coming over here and whoosh. And yeah, so me and Lossie are actually going to be racing with these things because they're so cool. And he literally made a cool racetrack. So as you guys can see, me and Lossie are about to race. Um, Can Doge count us down? Um, I I'll just count us down. So three, two, one, go. And I'm going to come over here. Oh my gosh, these cars are too fast. Oh no, I'm stuck. Oh no. Oh, let's go backwards. Oh my gosh. And I fell out of the track because I'm super bad at this. Oh my gosh. Uh, I think I have to restart. So let's come over here to here. And we're just going to come over here. This is way too fast for this racetrack. Oh my gosh. And oh, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. And we're just going to come right here. And woo. And we're going to come here. Let's go up this thing. Uh, can we get back on the track? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, uh, and let's go up that ramp like that, and oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, and I think, I think we all, we know who the winner is, Lossie, and thanks to him, this racetrack is actually really cool, like, he spent a lot of time in it, and there's actually this really cool thing where you guys can, like, choose a color right here, and one of them actually brings you down to the floor, and anyways, let's just get started with this tutorial. So guys, these are the mechanics made by Edward Garcia 34 and me name Shock. Me name Shock is like a cool YouTuber. Before you guys um, watch this video, you guys should go check out his video. And yeah, so um, these are all the mechanics. Um, let me put my transparency on. Yeah, it's already on zero, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, so it's already on zero. As you guys can see, you guys can like actually see these little plastic blocks doing something crazy. So, um, yeah, so basically it's like kind of like motor lock and boom, all these wheels are connected. And yeah, sub to Pukus, guys. Subscribe to Pukus. And as you guys can see, this is basically a fast wheel mechanic. And we, we could just be zooming on anything. So basically you guys can add this to any car you guys want. And, but it has to be these wheels right here. Because these wheels are like the most glitchiest wheels. So, oh my gosh, someone made my AFK grinder. Hey, Doge Place made my AFK grinder. Big shout out to him. Yeah, so go check out my AFK grinder video too. So anyways, let's just get started with this tutorial. So starting out with this thing. Yeah, so blah, blah, blah. We want anchor block actually on. And then we're going to um, put our merching level. Oh, this belief video might be coming soon yes yeah. first you guys want to go a decent amount up of pulls so i'm just going to be going up like three pulls like that then we're going to be getting a wheel right here so let's get a wheel um our wheel would be right here like that so we're going to be getting these two pistons right here one two like that we're going to be deleting this first piston and we'll extend this um you guys can set this extend length to six or five yeah five so then it could save some room so it doesn't the wheels aren't like all the way up there so let's come over here and boom now what we're going to be doing is connecting this wheel to this piston and let's um get like a plastic block because it's the lightest block and let's place two of them um and then we're going to be placing two like that and we're going to delete the middle one and i'm gonna set my scale to 0 0.5 and let's see let's scale down two and go up maybe one or go down all you guys want to go all the way down maybe and you guys want to scale this in like that and we're gonna put it in the wheel like that this doesn't have to actually be perfect it just has to be connected to the wheel so as you guys can see it's connected to the wheel and now we can just scale this right here and scale this inside the piston like that now we're just gonna be coming over here and getting this right here and connecting it to the piston like that now we can just um scale this in like that so we have that you guys can also make these plastic blocks way smaller so 
yeah um let me now you guys want to do is just get another wheel we're gonna be doing this four times so let's get another wheel right here we can retract this piston right here and we can get our piston right here and boom boom place two delete one or um get that and then we could actually um extend that one again and we're gonna set the extend length to five so let's put it to five and we're gonna come back right here and we're just gonna extend it once again now we just got to connect this thing so let's um connect it with this right here and we're gonna place two blocks again one two we're gonna delete this one and we're gonna scale this one all the way down and two over actually one over and then we're just gonna be placing it like that now we can just scale it inside the wheel and scale it as small as possible and now we just do this right here and we're just gonna scale it inside the piston it might not be perfect but it's fine so let's do it right there and now we can connect this block to that block and boom so now we can get another wheel right here so let's get another wheel and let's place it right here and boom so we retract this piston so we could actually place more pistons so let's come over here and place two pistons like that um, delete the first one and extend that one out. I forgot to put my extend length onto five. So let me do that real quick and retract this piston right here. And we're gonna um, place it back like that. And we're gonna be doing the same thing that we did before. We're gonna get um, our plastic blocks and right here and boom. And we're gonna place two. So boom, boom. Delete the middle and we're gonna scale this down and go one over and we're gonna go as thin as possible and boom so it's scaled in the wheel now we could go like that and we're gonna scale this all the way down and boom like that and then we could scale this inside the piston and we're just gonna scale this thing over like that and now we can just um scale that right in like that we're gonna um extend this piston out like that and you guys can actually do this as many times as you guys want and your wheels are gonna be super super fast but I think this might be a little too fast, so um, I'm gonna just delete this piston right here, delete that, delete that, and delete that. So at the end, what you guys can do is just um, place one wheel when you're done. So just place one wheel when you're done, and you guys can actually make this as fast as you want. So now we're actually gonna be duping this thing so we don't have to do it over and over again. And we're gonna um, place a seat like that. And now we're just gonna get, you guys wanna make your platform of your car or you guys can make this an extension of your car. Um, let me put all these pistons back how they were. And boom. So yeah. And now let me get um, any block. So I'm just going to be using plastic. You guys can make this platform as um, big as you want. And you guys can just use this in your normal builds. And I'm going to just extend. Um, let me put my scale to 2. And let me extend like that. And you guys want, so you guys will have four wheels and you guys can make this platform as big as you want where you guys actually want these wheels. Or you guys can do this right here onto a car and I'm just going to be doing it like that. I'm just going to be keeping it like this right here and um, this is a pretty good length that I think it is and I'm going to just place another seat right here. Because this is where we're going to put the wheel. So now we're just going to get ready to dupe it. And if you guys don't want your dupe to be like crazy. You guys need to place um, this block right here. And we're going to scale this down. And this is just going to cover up the wheel. So it doesn't have to be plastic. And it's just going to cover everything up. So then it doesn't glitch out when we actually dupe it. So now we let's just set this transparency to 25% so we could actually see through it. So now you guys just want to save this. So I'm going to save this in my fast car, race car slot. Now we're ready to dupe. So we're just going to be doing this simple duping glitch. And we're going to be getting a cake. So let's get a cake. And let's place it right here. And now we're going to be getting a lever right here. So let's get a lever like that. And we're going to be placing it Um inside us like that and then we're gonna be just getting a hinge inside our tummy and we're gonna put lace it right in there like that and now we can um actually delete all this stuff that we don't need um right here and now we can delete um this and since we already have it saved we can um unanchor everything like that and now we can delete the seat and boom so now we have our 
stooping thingy. So now we just want to get past the waterfall. Let me get a candy to make this faster. So let's get a candy. And boom. So we're just going to be coming over to the waterfall. And we're just going to be duping this. And we're going to do it um, two times. So let's come over here and let's get above right here. And now we guys want to just reload it right here. Reload your race car thingy and we're gonna come back over here so we have our thing loaded so now we can just delete this hinge right here and everything's connected still so we could just um, hop up um, if you guys have problems getting into that seat you guys can just place a portal like that and then we're just gonna get a portal right here and we're gonna go in this portal and boom so we actually faced the seat wrong so um, you guys want to face it the same way that you had over here so um, let me place the seat um, facing outward like um, that and now we can get our portal again so let's get a portal and we're gonna place it like that and boom so we're gonna come over here through this portal and you guys should be done with your dupe so now we can delete this portal and we're gonna save it right here we're gonna reload just like that and now um, everything's good so, so now um, we can select all and unanchor and then anchor and then we can just delete these right here we don't need them and boom so we have all this right here let's go ahead and save this once again so now we're gonna be placing another seat um we're just gonna be placing two of them just in case um, we uh, mess up on one so let's um, save this right here let's save it and we're gonna be doing this once again so Let's come up here and we're gonna come in this seat. And now we do the same thing that we did. We get a cake, a lever, and a hinge. So let's um, get our cake like that. And we're gonna get a lever. It's like that. And then we just get a hinge in our tummy once again. And boom, so we have our hinge in our tummy. Um, now everything should be connected and um, I need to actually connect this so um, let's connect these right here and we're just gonna connect it like that and now we can actually select all on anchor and now we're gonna delete all this because we don't need it and we're just gonna delete this pull and we're unanchored like that so now we're gonna get another candy right here let's get a candy right here and we're gonna get it right here and now we're just gonna be going to the end once again to dupe these wheels to get it all on the other side and we're above the stages so we can reload this like that and let's come back to our thing and we're gonna be duping this once again and you can see lossy drifting down there okay so um now we can delete this hinge because we don't need it anymore and Let's um, replace a portal. Um, let's see where we actually need to place this. Uh, let's see. Um, let's see if we go through here if this is right. And no, that is not right. Um, let's. Uh, um, so we actually want the seat facing inward. So let's delete this seat right here. And we want it facing inward like that. And we're going to place another portal right here so let's get another portal and we're gonna place it like that right on top of the seat so when we go through this portal it will take us right there and now we can just delete this portal and now we can save it right here so let's save it and boom so now we're gonna reload it and we're gonna select all and unanchor anchor like that and now we can just um, delete all the stuff that we don't need. Um, we, uh, we don't need these poles anymore. And I think that's it. Um, we don't need any of these cakes or seats or anything. So let's get rid of all that. And luckily we have our stuff anchored. So nothing will, um, happen. And now we can delete these, um, um, other plastic blocks since we're done duping. And we have all these wheels right here. It's going to be all extended. Now we're going to be co um, connecting these front wheels. So let's um, get our plastic block once again. And we're going to um, come over here. Let's um, put our scale to 0 0.1 so we can actually get this. We don't want it connected to the wheel, but we want it connected to the gray block in like that. We're just going to be bringing this platform down right here like that. And now all we got to do is get our servo. So this is what's actually going to be turning the car. So let's get some servos right here. 
Um, where are my servos? They're right here. Let's put our move to 0 0.5 and we're gonna get this exactly on point and it could be anywhere. I'm just gonna be placing it like that. And we're gonna place another one. Um, let's see, right there like that and boom. So we have our servos like that. We can delete this block right here and boom. So now we're gonna be connecting the servos to the wheels. So, so we're gonna get our plastic once again and we're gonna place it like that and place one. Um, let me actually put my move back to one so I don't get confused on anything. So let's place it like that. And we're gonna put our skill to 0 0.2. Let's put it to 0 0.2. And we're gonna go one in on each side because we don't want it actually connected to the um, darker gray of the servo. And we have it like that. So now we can scale it all the way down. And let's do the same for the other side. All the way down like that. And I'm gonna set my skill to 0 0.5 now and see how much um, I go in. So one, two is good enough. So let me do the same for the other side, one, two. And now we're gonna put our thing to 0 0.2 and we're gonna scale it as thin as possible. Let me put my scale back to one and we're gonna scale this inside the wheel and it's connected like that. So we're gonna do the same for this side like that and now we're going to be connecting the back part of the servo to the um to the main frame of the um car so let's um get our blocks like that we're going to put our rotate to 45 rotate like that and boom so we have these right here and i'm gonna put my scale to 0 0.5 let's see how much i go in so one two is good enough and one two so i'm gonna scale this thinner like that and boom and let me do it as thin and this thin and let me put my scale back to one and make sure it's skilled inside there so make it sure it's skilled inside um i think that's good and you guys can just um put your scale to 0 0.5 and go down one and let me do the same for the other side so i went up so that the little part was sticking out and let me put my move to scale to 0 0.2 now all we're gonna do now is just connect the rear wheels to the actual car so let's um come over here and let's make this thin so like that and that's pretty thin um yeah so we're gonna make this um f shorter like that um let me extend a little out and you guys and if you guys uh, ever um like it's not even or anything it doesn't matter it just has to be um connected to something so let's come over here and let's go like that boom and boom now wait did i um i think i went all the way right here and now we're just gonna line this up right here um go like that so i think i went like two in yeah two in and we just got to get one more block right here and we're gonna connect these to the wheel and we're just gonna scale that in and scale that in it's not actually perfect but it's fine it's actually connected and now we're just gonna scale a little down so it's connected to this block like that. You guys can just scale, you guys, if you guys want, you guys can scale this way um, littler and make it look perfect. So now our final step is to actually place our car seat. So let's place our car seat right here and everything's gonna be connected like that. We're gonna be key binding all these servos right here. So um, I'm pretty sure you guys can just select them like that that and we're just gonna select all these and we're gonna do um some custom key binds and let's click all these right here boom boom and um this one right here and let's come over here and boom 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 and now we can just select this chair and for push i'm just gonna do you guys can actually do anything i'm gonna do e and i'm gonna do as R or something and yeah and I this is actually connected to the piston right here and Lossie um, found out this so you guys don't want it connected to that piston so I'm gonna just scale it a little up like that now we're gonna be key binding these servos so let's click these and boom so to turn left we're gonna do D because it's actually reverse so um, turn right is A usually it'd be the other way around but the servos are reversed select all actually and um, unselect um, right here unselect by shift clicking and boom boom and shift clicking and then you guys want to 
turn collision off right here. And the last thing you guys can do is just set all these um, little plastic blocks invisible. So actually the shift lock is kind of getting annoying, so I'm gonna turn it off. And let's select all these little plastic blocks right here. And actually um, we could just select all like that. And we just don't want this to be invisible. And I think that's it. So we're putting transparency as 100 like that and as you guys can see we got our working wheel so now i'm gonna just save this in my fast race car slot and boom i just saved it and let's test this out so let's select all unanchor like that and um i think that was just a glitch right there because um lossy actually said that reloading it a couple times actually fixes it so i might have done something wrong and I have my pull on R so we can just go like that and whoosh we got our fast car like that and boom so I actually didn't um turn transparency on and this would be looking kind of crazy and we're just zooming like that and this is really cool we could just drift right here and zoom and drift like that and whoosh and this thing will actually be really fast you can you guys can use this to impress your friends and you guys can actually make a cool micro block design car like lossy did with his and yeah okay yeah i told him to come here for the outro anyways that'll be all for today and i hope you guys liked this tutorial and don't forget to leave a like and hit that subscribe button. Um, I, I actually um, got new merch and I forgot to tell you guys about that. But I got new Positivity merch and that will be all for today. See you later.